Hello, this is Minneapolis Millennium Fan. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're in No Man's Land. And, uh, where do I have a story for you today? Um, first of all, we're gonna try to get this thing unload, unfolded. Something I uh, seen in the mod hub, figure I'd try it out. There it goes. A little slow uh, unfolding. So let's get this planter going. I've got a story for you. Where I've been the last uh, month, month and a half. Planting corn in this field. I don't know if anybody's ever used a uh, cyber power computer before. Or if, or if you have, whether you had any problems or not. But uh, I bought my computer. Well, at the time when, it, when I uh, last recorded the video, it was three and a half months, almost three and a half months, that I had the computer. And uh, I went to turn, it worked one morning, I mean one evening, the next morning I went to turn it on, the computer wasn't working, wouldn't even boot up. Took it to Best Buy when I bought that. Best Buy wouldn't even look at it. Thing is only three and a half months old at that point. About five months old now. But uh, they wouldn't even look at it, not unless I uh, paid almost two hundred, one hundred ninety-two dollars for a yearly membership fee which I had to pay for them to look at it. They said, well, it's under warranty, send it back, because I think I tell them this. But it'll take too long. I just wanted to fix and get it back. I was willing to pay for it. And I paid the yearly membership fee that I had to pay for them to look at it. Waste of money. They did find out it was the uh, motherboard that went out on it. Which is strange, considering oh, the computer was only three and a half months old. And uh, they said, uh, since, since, uh, okay, sorry, since it was the motherboard that was wrong with it, they said they would try to send it in. And uh, I got a phone call back the next day saying, we can't send it in, you got to do it. He said, Best Buy will not allow us to send it in. It's something that you have to do. So I went to Best Buy, pick, picked it up. They gave me the information to uh, call Cyber Power. They're out of uh, California. And, uh, I got in contact with them. There was some information they that they had to email me for me to send it. I got the information and how they wanted it sent things. I went to UPS to uh, get this thing sent out, which I had to pay for shipping, which I don't agree with because uh, the computer's under warranty after all. But. I went to UPS to uh, get it shipped out to California. I live in Michigan. Boy, was I surprised. I think you will be too when I tell you how much it cost me to mail this computer to California. 
I had to pay. Oh well, I ain't gonna play at that part here. I had to pay three hundred to UPS to uh, send this thing to California. Now the computer cost uh, one thousand two hundred. My dad loaned me the money to get the computer in the first place because I didn't have it. So my dad told me just. Before I even sent it there, just well, let me loan you the money for another computer. I just started paying him back on the first one. I said, if I start owe you most of the money from the first computer. So I didn't want to do that. I'm starting to wish I did now. Because, uh, well, you're watching this video, so obviously I uh, got the computer back, and it's working, I got it fixed, but I'm $500 in to, a, to another brand new computer. I don't know if this is a problem with uh, cyber power computers. I've never had one before. I've never had any type of computer as expensive as this one before. I've never had a gaming computer. But I was having, with my other computer, I couldn't play the game on it no more. Um, it was suggested that I go with a gaming computer. Something with at least 16 gig of RAM and a terabyte of memory, so that's what I went with. But uh, I never thought it would go out just after three months. Now I'm afraid. Now that I've got it fixed, is it going to last about three months and go out again? I'll just have to wait and see. I have no idea. I don't feel I should have had to pay that three hundred dollars for shipping when the computer's on the warranty. But nothing I can do about it. In order to fix that, I had to send it down. But anyway, that's my story. That's what's happened to me the last uh, couple months. So I'm just wondering why I haven't been uh, putting out any videos lately. That would be the reason. So far, I'm liking this plan. It's all in one unit. Just a little too wide. Oh well. I'll finish up this uh, film. And got a pipe beer for this video. One thing I was wondering too, 
because it takes for some with my internet the way as slow as it is, eight to twelve hours to load one of these videos. Upload it to YouTube. And I got thinking, is that the problem with the motherboard? Why the motherboard cried on But the guy at best I mentioned because I'm new at YouTube. I've never done these type of these videos before until I got this computer. And they said, no, what's the type of computer you bought? That's, that's what it's designed for. It's designed to handle that. Because uh, it's on 18, at least 18 hours a day. So, I don't know. I'm not too sure what happened to it. But Best Buy did agree with me that the computer was bad from the from the very beginning when I first bought it. So, if anybody watches this, oh, still's all done. Hold it up. Raise it. Hold it up. Come on. If anybody watching this uh, has any experience with cyber power computers, and uh, they let me know whether this problem is a cyber power computer problem or it was just a bad motherboard that they ended up putting in it. It was just a uh, I don't know. I'm just curious whether it's a problem with all cyber power computers, or I just happen to buy uh, a bad computer. Oh, got the corn planted. Um can do a little more. Do I have a sprayer here? Here's one. 
Let's see. Have this one. I don't need one that big. I have a used one here. I can pick up. Drive into town. Need to add some stuff to the town. Sometime. Right, need to finish that up too. We need a driveway put in. Some more uh, equipment, used equipment. Needs to be filled. Uh, herbicide. the computer will last a while this time, instead of just three months. That way I can keep putting out videos. I have been putting out um, videos from the tractor shows that I went to. Hopefully you've been enjoying them. from uh, the Michigan Flywheelers Museum and the uh, Power from the Past show in Napanee, Indiana. The Michigan Flywheelers Museum, that's located in South Haven, Michigan. Unfolded. And not if I be it for this video. I'll get this done. I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Catch you on the next one.